I've been hearing loud and clear from health care workers from around the country that they're worried, that they don't feel prepared to take care of a patient with Ebola, that they're very distressed that one of our colleagues now has contracted Ebola and is fighting the infection in Dallas. A single infection in a health care worker is unacceptable. Every doctor, every nurse, every staff person in an emergency department who cares for someone with fever or other signs of infection needs to ask, where have you been in the past month? Where have you been in the past 21 days? Have you been to Liberia, Sierra Leone, or Guinea? That's important. That will reduce the risk that someone will come into a hospital and not be diagnosed. The second thing that we will be doing starting today is establishing a CDC Ebola response team for any hospital anywhere in the country that has a confirmed case of Ebola, we will put a team on the ground within hours with some of the world's leading experts in how to take care of and protect health care workers from Ebola infection.